I've seen Bros now with some audiences in movie theaters, and it's it's so fun. It's such a joyful experience to be back in a theater laughing with people again. I think people have forgotten how much fun it is to sit in a movie theater with hundreds of other people, your friends, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, or even alone, and just laugh together. It, it, this is a movie that makes you feel good about life. It's uplifting, it's joyful, and we need movies like that. We don't get a lot of comedies in movie theaters anymore. For some reason, Hollywood decided those are something to watch at home. And I love watching things at home, we all do. But there's something so special about sitting with people and laughing together, having that communal experience, you know? It's just, it makes you feel good. It's like a party in the movie theater every time we screen bros. And I can't wait for more people to have that experience. It's just fun. It's just a blast. It's for everyone. Straight people relate to it. Gay people, LGBTQ, that's the beauty of it. You know, uh, it, this is not a movie for one specific group of people. It's very specifically about a group of people, but the emotions, the experiences are, are very similar. The emotions are the same. You know, we see audiences full of straight people who laugh wildly, audiences of gay people who can obviously relate to it and laugh a lot, and uh, it's thrilling. It really is. It's the funniest cast ever. You know, it's the most delightful, warm, endearing cast. We were constantly making each other laugh. Uh, but, you know, your job is to, like, you know, keep a straight face. Judd Apatow has made some of the funniest movies of all time. Bridesmaids, 40-Year-Old Virgin, Knocked Up, Trainwreck. Nick Stoller, who directed this and I wrote it with, made Forgetting Sarah Marshall and the Neighbors movies. These are really big, successful comedy hits that everyone loves. And But we've never had a movie like that about a gay couple. And it's long overdue, and I'm just very grateful to be a part of it.